Hello, welcome to my vlog on Cozy Conventions of YouTube. Copyright of YouTube is fairly simple to say. If you created a video, copyright probably belongs to you. If you upload content created by somebody else, copyright belongs to that person. And um, you don't have permission to use it basically. Uh, as soon as the work is created, so is copyright. It's basically if you don't if you create something that's new, it's yours. If you don't, then you have to copyright it. Uh, since nineteen ninety two there is there's no longer a renewal process. Copyright lies with the creator. Even if lives on for a period. No, come on. I love it. Um To know the consequences, uh, YouTube takes copyright quite seriously. It can block or take down any videos that infringes on copyright. Two things can happen, and they both sound similar, but they're completely different. Uh, you can be banned, or you can be kicked off YouTube, basically. <laughs> because why not? Um, Criticism for it. Um, reviewing a movie or some form of music makes it perfectly acceptable to use copyrighted material without permission. For example, short clips of the work you critis critique. A parody. If you're po po promoting one that's something, it's acceptable to use content without gaining permission first. Commentary. This one depends on how you can use the material if it's used just enough to illustrate your points. This is acceptable as well. For instance, gamers on YouTube often re record themselves playing a new video game and funny observations with this. This is within limits. You are free to use it. You should not let uh, the copyright on news on YouTube uh, make you not want to do it. Uh, the common understanding of playing baseball, but in baseball you get another chance. Uh, YouTube doesn't share this, so if they give you strikes, especially for copyright issues, it means you have a lifetime ban. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, there's something you don't want on your record, worse yet. Once that happens to you, you won't be able to record the cover of any of your videos. So you want to avoid getting strikes at all costs. There are two types of strikes on YouTube. Uh, community guideline strikes and copyright. Community guideline uh, so results in a various of reasons ranging from uploading objectionable content and having a misleading thumbnail or caption. It's basically rudeness. And the copyright, um, if some part of your video can include content from another creator and that creator does not grant permission, uh, you get a strike. You can also get a Constant ID claims lodged against you. Because, um, people don't want it too. So that's my blog on the code conventions of YouTube. I hope you've enjoyed and I will see you.